Hey everyone, welcome into WKIG 33. We have an amazing special guest here. Give it up for Josh Hutcherson. <laughs> we came up with an amazing uh, commercial of you. Are you serious? Um, from when you were a little, little one. So we're oh, gonna go no. ahead and roll that. <laughs> well, he came to town on like five TV channels. Huh? If you don't believe me, ask your mom. For me, since I was like five years old, I was saying I wanted to like, I was like acting out performances for my family and saying I wanted to be in movies or all these kind of things. And finally, when I was nine years old, I got a, uh, a local Cincinnati phone book and I called an agency myself when I was nine. Uh, when you called your first movie? Oh, good question. Ah, uh, yeah. What was like when I played my first movie? Uh, I I was so excited. Like I I I don't really remember being that nervous. I just remember being really excited and I felt like. This is what I'm meant to be. It sounds like cheesy and like cliche, but it just like, it felt right. What kind of things do you like to do when you're back in town? I like to just relax. Cause like in LA, there's so much going on all the time and there's so many people and just stuff happening nonstop. So when I come back in Kentucky, um, where I'm from, I just like to just like, just, you know, release. We play a lot of board games. Um, so we're a big board game family. And, and there's one game it's probably the nerdiest game in the entire universe, and it's called Twilight Imperium. It takes roughly six and a half hours to play one game of it, and you play as different like alien races throughout this game. It's so nerdy. You know? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I'm a total geek. He kept us laughing the whole time. I have never felt so happy. <laughs> My heart literally was about to explode. And we are gonna play Heads Up. Have you ever seen yes. that on Ellen? Yes. A lot of movies with her. I film a lot of movies with her? Yeah. Is it Jennifer? Favorite uh, baseball team? Cincinnati Reds. Um, it's off of Frozen and he loves um, summer. Olaf? Oh, I can't believe I got that one actually. <laughs> That's really, uh, it's like Olaf, it is in my brain. So we were wondering if there's any time where you didn't necessarily get a role you wanted and what you can tell them about perseverance. Oh yeah, uh, this job is a lot of rejection. A lot of times where you feel judged and you feel like you're not good enough. Um, and how I persevere through that is you focus on what you love, I think. You focus on your, your, your passion. For some people it's music, for some people it's family, sports, painting, drawing, whatever it is, everybody has their thing that they're into. And so every time that you know I get that kind of rejection, I try to just focus on my perspective and I try to keep a positive perspective and, and, I, and I look at all the great things that you do have.